Song of Songs, Chapter 5 My bride, my very own, I come to my garden and enjoy its spices. I eat my honeycomb and honey. I drink my wine and milk. Eat and drink until you are drunk with love. I was asleep, but dreaming. The one I love was at the door knocking and saying, My darling, my very own, my flawless dove, open the door for me. My head is drenched with evening dew. But I had already undressed and bathed my feet. Should I dress again and get my feet dirty? Then my darling's hand reached to open the latch, and my heart stood still. When I rose to open the door, my hands and my fingers dripped with perfume. My heart stood still while he spoke to me. But when I opened the door, my darling had disappeared. I searched and shouted, but I could not find him. There was no answer. Then I was found by the guards patrolling the town and guarding the wall. They beat me up and stripped off my robe. Young women of Jerusalem, if you find the one I love, please say to him, she is weak with desire. Most beautiful of women, why is the one you love more special than others? Why do you ask us to tell him how you feel? He is handsome and healthy, the most outstanding among ten thousand. His head is purest gold. His hair is wavy, black as a raven. His eyes are a pair of doves bathing in a stream flowing with milk. His face is a garden of sweet-smelling spices. His lips are lilies dripping with perfume. His arms are branches of gold covered with jewels. His body is ivory decorated with sapphires. His legs are columns of marble on feet of gold. He stands there, majestic, like Mount Lebanon and its choice cedar trees. His kisses are sweet. I desire him so much. Young women of Jerusalem, he is my lover and friend.